Good morning. First of all, I want to start out by thanking all of Canada's cattlemen for their interest and our customers particularly for their support. They, uh, their support certainly gave us a near record sale in spite of all the COVID issues we had to face and deal with that we all deal with every day, really. Um, but although we had our sale and it was a great success uh, and our customers trusted us to deliver the bulls they wanted through our sight unseen program or in person, um, the folks that have dealt with us for a long time know that if there's trouble, we're certainly going to be there and that the sale doesn't end the day the hammer falls. Our bull sale offering spread uh, from the Maritimes through Quebec, Ontario and the Western provinces as we enjoyed uh, support from many repeat and new customers to our program. Particular highlight this year was, uh, you know, the real acceptance and power in our hybrid programs. We were fortunate to be able to stage our sale in the beautiful facilities of the Lloydminster Exhibition where we have uh, 45,000 square feet and we're able to space people out and, uh, and adhere to all the Sask Health protocols that were prescribed. And, you know, we had a really successful live auction with a tremendous number of orders and a tremendous number of telephones um, to give us a solid sale, which was actually up some from a year ago. We spread our bulls from the Maritimes through uh, Quebec, Ontario, and all the western provinces and into South Dakota. So we certainly enjoyed the support of cattlemen from right across the country. One of the things that really, uh, really made our sale a uh, success this year was the real acceptance of our sight unseen purchase program. Normally it sells a third of our bulls this year. It will have sold in excess of, our, of half our bulls. Um, as customers give us their confidence, we deliver the bulls with a satisfaction on arrival, pay when you see them guarantee. And uh, customers just really appreciate it, especially in a year uh, of COVID when none of us can go very many places. We started the sale with our offering of uh, solid red Angus bulls, uh, 60 some red Angus bulls, average 55, 63, with a top of 15,000, and lots of really good, solid, affordable bulls in the 4,500 to $5,500 range. One thing we did notice this year is we sold a lot more bulls to breed heifers, so Good, good sign that cattlemen are really optimistic about the future. The second line of bulls to, uh, to be in our sale ring were our really popular red super baldy bulls. Um, these bulls averaged 72 75 as they just sold on solid demand all day. As our customers appreciate the opportunity to infuse the Simmental and Red Angus genetics in one shot, it's convenient, it's easy, and uh, more and more customers figure that out every year. We followed the Super Baldies with our Super Guppy Bulls, which are, you know, some people or the industry now calls them balancers, but we've been selling them for 25 years. They enjoyed record success as well, averaging 5803, which is uh, as high as those bulls have sold in many years. Our popular H2 Bulls uh, this year were probably the strongest set we've had in a long time, and certainly the price reflected that. Uh, they averaged 7338 with a high of 10,000 and lots of good solid big white faced goggle eyed bulls uh, that traded at six to seven thousand dollars. Certainly, uh, as we've always said, these bulls will do everything the Herefords will do and more, and customers are coming to realize that more every year. Most of these bulls probably went to breed black cows. Our Hereford bulls, though low in number because we use so many of our Herefords in our H2 production program, Average 5431 on a really strong demand for these lower set, thick, meaty horned Hereford bulls with the horns taken off them. We moved into the black division of our sale next with our black super baldy bulls, where they averaged 6725 with a high of 115. Um, and lots of good bulls traded around the $5,000 plus or minus a little bit. You know, when we started this sale, we had uh, 10 or 11 people on the phone and lots of orders. And, uh, you know, cattlemen across Canada appreciate and understand that these black uh, hybrid bulls will just infuse that little bit of muscle that the black cows need to bring the top dollar. We moved next into our black Angus bulls, which had extremely strong demand, topped at $20,000. Um, but really solid bulls uh, all day in the $5,000 range ended up averaging just in excess of $5,800 um, on about 70 bulls. So 
Very strong black sale, up probably almost $1,000 from a year ago. We close our sale with our with our Charlet bulls, although our numbers aren't large here and we're ramping that up every year. These good bulls sold to average $6,344 with a high of $92.50 and uh, just really good, solid, affordable, virgin summer two Charlet bulls that just really deliver a lot of punch and a lot of value and uh, certainly our average is down a little on them, but that's great. Uh, more cattlemen are able to participate. So our overall average on 337 bulls was 6308, which is up significantly over last year, but on about 45 less bulls. We trimmed our numbers up a little because of COVID. Um, very interesting, you know, cattlemen are resourceful and resilient people and they just found a way to buy their bulls, whether it was on the telephone or they came to the ranch ahead of time. Um, you know, we were all very concerned, but we're all so thankful to be in the industry we're in where the people are resilient and resourceful and salt of the earth. So thanks very much, and we'll see you down the road.